loves Giovanni Conti. As a child, I had a dream, a dream of family and a big business going well. I kept following my dream, but if one dream won't end, another one will begin. I done time in jail. It was very cold. Uh, you met a lot of strange and weird people. All got stories about who they know, what they know, and, you know, up that themselves. But I kept to myself and uh, just did me time. And it was very scary. Very long time ago, I was in a car accident, and uh, I just remember waking up in hospital. A month later, I was in a coma, and uh, tried to uh, re-establish myself and try to focus and remember what happened. But still, as today, I still can't recall what actually happened. I'm John's sister, Carmel. I'm his younger sister. When John, my brother, had to go to jail for three months, I never forget when in court there he was. All he said was, make sure you kiss mum and tell her I'm okay. And then they took him away. We couldn't even say goodbye properly. Um, it was sad that he had to go for a silly reason. You know, just not paying fines, which was hard for him. And But I think it did him good too, to realise what jail was about. He did his time and he learned, and he realised that out there, there are some bad people. My name's uh, Tony. I'm uh, John's brother-in-law. When John was in jail, um, well, obviously it, was, it wasn't good for the family. You know, he would beat the charge because he's, you know, he's gone to court before. And at the end of the day, it was just a traffic violation. But, you know, too many, uh, too many incidents, too many um, misdemeanors, and yeah, he uh, had to go to jail. John can improve. Um, I always say, you know, why don't you try and get a job? And uh, his response is, who's going to give me a job? I haven't got a licence. Um, I'm almost 50. I said, well, if you don't try, you'll never find out. I heard the story that um, his brother-in-law, Bill, um, was driving the car. John was being silly, jumped on the boat um, and run him down. Um, I think... They were both to blame. Um, apparently the ambulance turned up and he, they pronounced him dead and Uncle, the late Uncle Jack uh, wouldn't accept it. So he's um, punched John on the chest a few times and apparently uh, blood started coming out of his ear or his nose and he started breathing again. So, But having said that, um, I've been talking to the family since I've been, I've been in the family for over 20 years. Um, they said, well, that was the start of John's, you know, backflip on life. He started, uh, you know, finding life tough after that. So, in a way, that was the start of his demise. Uh, my name is uh, Guglielmo Paolo Cristiano. My friends call me Bill. This is my wife, Anna Maria Cristiano. My relationship is that he's my brother. He's my third sibling. Obviously, he's uh, my brother-in-law. What was it like to see John go to jail? Well, um, obviously, it was a little bit stressful for the family. The fact that um, he went for three months, I think, in the end, um, is probably a good thing. Maybe he'd uh, set him straight, and we hope that he'd come out of it a little bit wiser and uh, also you know, reflect on what he's done wrong and improve his life and, and go forward in a positive sense. Living with his mother, he's on the doll. He doesn't want to put a foot forward to find work. It took a lot of uh, emotion out of, um, out of me, um, out of the family, um, hoping that he would be, become a better person and realise the mistakes that he had made in his life. after the three day coming up, he come to me and give a kiss, mommy. Probably he nervous because he don't have money. He's too much nervous. 
Massa supporto, con Johnny Goy in inciaio, mi ha passetti, Massa passetti, cosa massano con l'inciaio. È bello, nice, good boy, bring school, tamen, all the life they ever died.